In this video, I will finally show you how I've integrated some roller shades into my dashboard. This is something that has been requested from day one of my YouTube channel, and we're finally doing it today. The shades I have here is from a company called Canisteo Blinds. They kindly sent over two of these for my living room, so thank you to them. Canisteo have a variety of blinds and shades to choose from, but the ones I selected are the Roller Shades Blackout Aura type. I think these shades look great, and they fit right into our living room. The fabric is high quality and blocks out the light completely. I absolutely would recommend these as an affordable option, even if Canisteo didn't ask me to make a video about them. When ordering, I opted for no solar panel, because we just want nice, big, and clean windows when the shades are fully open. The package came with a long USB charging cable, and the battery seemed to last for a decent amount of time. They were about 70% when I got them, and they are still above 50% today. The package also came with a remote control that was pre-programmed for my two shades. You will need this remote if you want to adjust the upper and lower limits, as well as the speed of the motor. It would be nice if it was possible to adjust these things in Home Assistant, but it's pretty easy to do with the remote. I've set mine at the slowest speed to limit the noise. I'm not sure what's a normal noise level, but these seem quiet to me. The package also came with these L-shaped light blockers. They help block out the light from the sides, but they also act as a track for the shade so that they don't interfere with plants and other stuff we have in the window frame. Another nice thing about these shades is that they are custom made to order. So when you order, you just put in the width and height, and when they arrive, they will fit perfectly into your window frame. These shades are matter over thread, and since these are my very first matter devices, I had to do some tinkering to set it all up in Home Assistant. But once I had my matter server and thread working, it was a breeze to integrate into Home Assistant. You can't really see it that well on the video, but I held the button for a few seconds to enable pairing mode. Then in Home Assistant, I go into Settings, Devices and Services and Devices. From here, I can add a new matter device. I then just have to scan the QR code to add the device to the network. It actually took me a while, but I eventually found the QR code at the back of the fabric. It could sometimes take a little while to add them to the network. The first time I did this, I had to select my Wi-Fi network. But for the second blinds, I just had to wait for the automatic process. Since setting up the shades a few weeks ago, they have been rock solid. There's a few cool blueprints available for Home Assistant, but we mostly tend to use the remote or the dashboard controls. It's not like we always want to block out all lights, so closing the shades based on sun position seemed a bit wrong to me. We have a movie night scene that closes the shades, and that works really well. And we also have an automation that runs in the morning to open the shades to let light in. For my dashboard, I've created a card using my new favorite card, the expander card. Here I've added a slider as the title card. This controls both shades through a group that I've set up. If I open the expander card, I can adjust them individually, and I also have presets for various positions. I also played around with displaying the battery percentage, but I ended up with just using a notification that tells me to charge them when one of the shades hits 20 or less percent. You can find the code for this card in the video description. Overall, I'm really happy with these two shades. The integration with Home Assistant seems very stable, and they look really cool when they're moving up and down simultaneously. I want to look into more automation ideas, but I also feel like shading in the living room is about current mood and needs, and it's hard to automate that kind of stuff. My plan now is to add more shades around the house, especially in our bedroom and the kids' rooms. And I think Canisteo Blinds is a great and affordable solution for this. Let me know in the comments if you have any ideas for automations, or if you have any feedback about my dashboard card. Thanks for watching.